Hey guys, it's uh, me, Agent Kenshin. Uh, I'm here with the new. I'm here with the new map. Uh, it's, it's, uh, the score. Yeah, so it's uh, one of the brand new stealth maps added to uh, the day heists, and uh, we're gonna play some the score. It's actually the. It's actually stealth only, but uh, it's pretty easy on loud. So we're gonna play this on um, legend difficulty, and uh, we're gonna set it to. We're gonna set it to friends, and we're gonna set it to one. And then we're going to get started. I totally didn't just set it to rookie. Uh, this is we're actually trying to get the badge today to do this on stealth. So I'm gonna show you guys a quick tutorial uh, on how to do this. I'm gonna be the first person to ever have done this stealth because uh, uh, it is currently February fourth, twenty nineteen, and freelance heist just released today. So yeah, um, we're going to be. You're doing some stealth mission. You're gonna need a couple things for this. One of the things you're gonna need is a key card scrambler, a lock pick, and that is it. That's just the usual shit that you bring to stealth. So let's go. All right. So you load in. Don't mind whoever this is. It's just a. This is just a bug. This. Uh, so don't mind that. Uh, that's just a bug. So you're gonna want to enter here. Uh, you're, you're gonna need to lock pick it. All right. So as you can tell, I just lock picked it. So what you want to do next is. Look around for any guards. If you can get a disguise, you might want to get one as soon as possible. Don't mind all the shooting. That's just a weird glitch. I think it's a shaman needs to patch it. So next thing you need to do is find the right door. To uh, Sorry, you need to find the right computer. Um, man, Shano really needs to fix this fucking game. Jesus Christ, what are you doing? So, uh, this is stealth only, like I said. So what you want to do is hack this computer. It'll take, like, quite a while. It'll take... It shouldn't take a lot of time. It should take 10 hours. Oh, uh, hang on. There's a guard here. Uh, let me just knock him out. And let me take his disguise. Alright, so once you're done hacking that computer and you take this guy's disguise, you want to be very quiet for this part. Um, you're going to want to breach this door. Uh, you're going to need a, so you're gonna need a lock pick. Uh, don't mind this. This is, a, this is actually a mod I added into the game. The, uh, the lock pick. You can actually use it from far away. And it's also used as a... Uh, yeah, so you open this. Uh, there should be no more guards around. Uh, and you actually should be able to blend in fine with the other SWAT members. I don't know why they changed the guards to SWAT members. And so once you you hack this computer now, um, yeah, that'll take like ten hours. Once you're done with that, you search these printers to find out which truck you need to, which of the five trucks you need to open. Kill these guards while you're at it because they're fucking annoying. Oh fuck, there's more of them right here. Alright, so once you do that, you wanna just like make your way out discreetly. And so then uh, all the other five trucks disappear and you want to just unlock this one. Uh use the lock pick. Alright, so like I said, you wanna get your key card. Uh don't mind me, this is the same I'm just using mods right now. I'm hacking the game actually. It's the show I'm trying not to ban me for uh, uh using hacks. Alright, so, uh, once you do that, you want to make sure to actually avoid the road. This is where, like, most of the guards are. I don't know why. Um, so turns out, also, there's this, like, really weird glitch where a SWAT van shows up and, uh, takes all your gold. So you want to make sure to avoid that car at all costs because it will... Oh, shit, here it is. Why did I put away my gun? I didn't even press it. Um, so the SWAT van is now here. I have my second piece of gold. So what you want to do now is you want to actually access, instead of actually taking this away from uh, to the van where you actually just showed up on, what you want to do... Oh, fuck. All right, so uh, these guys come down here and open this door for you. I know we opened it earlier with the lock pick, but don't mind me. Don't mind that I'm in armor. Uh, it's just actually a texture. Uh, that I got for my uh, SWAT disguise. You, actually, you can wear two disguises. One of them is the uh, SWAT disguise, and one of them is the SWAT Aegis disguise. So the guards on this map are very generous when it comes to doing mixed runs. Although, like I said, this is stealth only, but you can do loud if you want to. So, uh, loud is actually incredibly easy, though. Um, so yeah, you take this gold over up to this building, um, and... Uh, you guys are actually going to like this one. If you haven't played, spoiler alert, you probably have played this map, but you haven't played this map. I know, it sounds weird, but you'll understand that. So what you do now is you grab this gold, uh, easy peasy, lemon, squeezy, uh, kill these guards, because they're kind of in your way. <coughs> uh, 
Uh, hang on, you might want to answer this guy's radio, because uh, he's he's got a radio out. Once you answer his radio, uh, see, look at that, he disappeared, because uh, I answered his radio. That's a new feature they added into the game. Uh, so once you do that, you press this button, and that happens. And now you're going up. Uh, you see, there's no more gunshots. That's because you now have to do this next part, stealthy. You have to open this elevator door, and wait for it, wait for it. That's right, this is the map from Halloween Horror uh, 2020, even though this map came out in 2019. So, yep. Um, so once you do that, you quietly want to make your way to the roof. Uh, there's going to be a guard, like, right here, yes. Yeah, you going to hear a uh, don't mind these snipers, uh, you just, uh, they're here for cosmic, they're here for, uh, yeah, see, look at that, I sniped that guy. So you want to, like, make your way around this. For some reason, they can't see through the game. So, yeah, that's a cool feature they added. Um, there's another sniper right here, you want to take all these guys out. Uh, it's part of the Halloween horror, um, despite it being January. Don't ask me. I don't know why Sashana was coded in such a way, but they did. I think I left my bag with the med kits in it at the start. Oh well, who cares? Alright, so once you get this bag up here, um, you're actually gonna have a helicopter come in and shoot you out. Uh, you're actually stealing Ryan Ross's helicopter from the uh, original stuff map, uh, the lake house. That's why um, this is a spell only map. Uh, you wanna kill these guards? There's a lot of fucking guards today. So there's a. You wanna do that, and then. Yeah, and once again, don't mind the gunshots. So, this part's a little tricky. You can't do it. You have to go this in this specific order. If you do it any other way, hey, look, there's my car. If you do it in any other order, then the guards will see you and they will open fire, and that just ruins the stealth mission. Uh, once again, this is on legend difficulty, so it is quite hard. Um, <coughs> so, you want to quietly make your way up the stairs. No, you cannot jump with the gold. Um, and, uh, if we had escaped via the roads down there, the stuff would have failed, so we're bringing them up here. So what you want to do is, you want to go all the way around here, drop the gold, get it up here, drop the gold right here, drop the gold right here, and then come up here, grab the gold, and then go up the stairs. And see, look at that, no more guards. Look at that, this is crazy. So, you do that, and the mission is done. <clears throat> Alright, so yeah, that is how you do... Oh, look at that, that's Ryan Ross right there. Uh, you actually didn't even know him yet. But it turns out this is a map called Lake House coming up. Yeah, uh, so that is how you do this. Uh, as you can see, the score, legend, uh, no alarms. Uh, as you can see, it's dark because I didn't activate any alarms. No kills, I didn't activate any kills. I did activate the difficulty though, and I did activate my own goal bonus. It's actually pretty generous. Um, I actually lost a lot of money due to the gear. You see, uh, this EP9 is actually $2,000. Now, I don't know why she's trying to have that here. Emergency EP9 really is not high for stealth. But yeah, that is how you do that. So if you learned anything from this video, um, make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Uh, this is one of the hardest stuff notes in the game, and I'm glad I got to walk you guys through it. This should really help. I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.